Good rhymers are good readers, Kelly. Good rhymers are good readers. This week's question is, I heard another mom work on rhyming with her three-year-old. Is that important? A resounding answer to that question is yes, absolutely yes. Research tells us that good rhymers are good readers. Research also tells us that the concept of rhyming is pretty abstract for kids. Sometimes it has to be explicitly taught. So even talking about the word rhyming and what it means to rhyme, oh, those words sound the same at the end, oh, the sound at the beginning changes, will help kids to learn rhyming. First, they may start to identify some words that rhyme, some words that don't rhyme. Second, they may start to generate their own rhymes. So one of the best ways to work on rhyming in the beginning is make it fun and be silly with it. So I can be mummy, tummy, bummy, or my little guy can be Emmett, Bemmett, Temmett. So it's okay if the rhyming is silly and they're nonsense words, it does make it more fun to work on and more motivating to practice. So start looking through your collection of your books and start finding all the rhyming ones. I try to incorporate one rhyming book a night with my child at home. And also, uh, it's okay if it's not specifically a book built on rhyming. You can just embed some rhyming words in there. And don't forget that the library can be a fantastic resource for rhyming books. And also, it can be really great if you can find some books secondhand. A tip for rhyming is that the first rhyming family that's usually taught is the at family. I would pick a letter and I would start with hat. And then I would ask the child to pick a letter or I would pick a letter and we would talk about how the first letter changes but the last letter in the word stays the same. These are called word families. You can move on to the OP word family and then just roll through the initial letters, make fun words, make meaningful words, and make the ones that are nonsense. Don't, Don't forget, forget, good rhymers make good readers. Join us next week for a new question about early literacy skills.